Hello, my name is Rich Howard, owner of Architectural Builder Supply. This video is to bring you a closer look at the PEMCO. This is their part number P365V16. This is a roll of gray vinyl garage door seal. This is what it looks like when it arrives, and it will come in that packaging. I've removed it for purposes of this video. Okay, Weighs about 1.6 pounds, I think, something in that range. And a couple of ways to look at this here now. The flange that is attached to the face of the door on the leading section at the bottom or on the jams would be this portion here. Okay, This area down here is what will make contact with the either the side, um, either the face of the sectional overhead door or the sill, naturally. They don't give us an overall height, but they're telling us the flat section before the bend is about 7 eighths, and that's reasonably accurate. And that sealing up to a 3 quarter inch gap would be something that you could expect to have. And I would say that you'd probably be reasonable to expect that as well. Okay. This feature down here to this extruded piece of vinyl is going to just simply serve as giving you additional surface area, I think is the point of that. Okay. This is going to, and it's only available in a 16 foot roll. Um, I can't really think of residential applications that would require more than that uh, on a single door. Uh, nails are included, I would call these roofing nails. Large head, thick body, made of steel, corrosion resistant coating. Two bags of those, plenty of nails. Okay. And the packaging includes the installation instructions, which are linked to down below this video that we can take a look at. But an angle type weather strip like this is very typical and common in overhead door work. Uh, and it does a very, it provides a very effective seal on the uh, jams and at the leading edge again, as I said down below, I will often see people install angled material on overhead doors that are either vinyl or sometimes bristle, and bristle is very effective as well. What's nice about bristle, which of course Pemco makes, it's available in longer lengths. So if you have a larger door or a door with more features to it, an embossed style door, or even a, a textured finish, you might want bristle, because bristle will serve to fill that in a little bit better than something, while it's not rigid, uh, I would say that it, you know a, a leading edge of vinyl might be a little less um, capable of tailoring itself to a, a, a textured surface. Okay, um, Vinyl is a very standard caliber uh, component used in weather stripping. It's not exceptional when it comes to exposure to ultraviolet. Uh, they do say that it's very long lasting. I would submit that anything vinyl exposed to sunlight will fatigue and fail eventually, but like all things, things need to be maintained and that's very likely why you're looking at this video and buying this product. You need some seal. You don't want to have it you don't want your doors, your overhead doors, completely um, mm. open to the elements of, of wind, of moisture coming through. Just the inclusion of some standard basic weather stripping like this will go a long way to just helping separate the two areas, assuming that your garage is, is likely, like most of course, just unheated. Um, and you might just be looking to keep out insects as well as best you can, things of that nature. So let's switch to the screen view and take a closer look at the supporting documentation of this item. Okay, so this is indeed the item that we are looking at. The P365 vinyl 16 foot. Um, we're just going to have to go with the idea that that is 16 foot. I'm not going to unroll that. So I'm not going to get it in tight of a circle or a, a coil back to go back to the client. So extended description information tells us 5 eighths width. Um, not sure where that's coming from. Gray and vinyl. Vinyl is a very typical component that is used in weather stripping uh, components. There's a link here to the installation instructions, and that is literally part of the packaging of the item when you receive it. So not a lot to see here. Um, in addition to what we've discussed, big headed nails included, seals up to three quarter gap, seals out drafts, dust and water. 
long lasting. I would say that that would be subjective. If this is uh, vinyl, does not perform very well with extreme prolonged exposure to ultraviolet. So it may not be something that is a permanent solution. Um, vinyl does fatigue with exposure to sunlight. Flexible at high and low temperatures. Okay, it's vinyl. It's not going to be exceptional at very low temperatures once it's been frozen down to the concrete. Cushions and absorbs door closing shock. I would say it would do very little to absorb the closing shock of a door, mm -hmm. of an overhead door making contact with the uh, concrete. Um, so take that for what it's worth. Shows you what's happening. We're obviously inferring that you can apply it to the um, face of the material. Okay. Now they're going to want that feature pointed down. That's going to be nice to increase your surface area. Nails, they're showing you applying it to the um, jams. So they're saying it's obviously appropriate for use in vertical and the lower horizontal section as well. There's that detail. Okay. Okay, back to the top of the page. Does show what it looks like installed. Uh, which, you know, admittedly is um, you know, the way that you'll install it either on the bottom of the door or on the jams. There's a link here below this video to the manufacturer's page where you can pull up not only all of the Pemco products that we sell as we scroll down here by means of this horizontal navigation. But there's also a link to the manufacturer's website as well as a link to the full product catalog. The full product catalog is awfully handy because we can review, we can search for that P365V16, control F, and then the part number. Just waiting for the document to index. Okay, so there's the chart and table that shows us the different options. Those different options can also be viewed down below in this table that we've created that is meant to emulate that. Links to the items, instructions, cut sheets, things of that nature. Okay, let's wrap up this video on camera. Okay, in conclusion, a very typical item. There is that chart that I had mentioned below that will allow you to review the other options available with this. Uh, you know, garage overhead garage door seal is a very typical and common item for Pemco to sell. What's uh, nice about Pemco is they have such a wide range of available uh, options when it comes to weather stripping in general. That link I showed you just prior to their catalog, I would very much encourage you to review that, especially if you're not sure what you need or you're open to multiple possible solutions or you're looking for ideas and their catalog is a tremendous resource because they just have more line items of ideas than any other manufacturer does. Um, 200 plus pages worth of the material. So good quality people over at Pemco as well. Any questions on the P365 V16 weather strip or any other Pemco product, please feel free to reach out to us and thank you.